Today we're going to make this duct tape cheer bow. You need two colors of duct tape and a rubber band. The first thing you're going to do is measure your base color. You want this to be 30 inches long and you're going to need four pieces of 30 inch duct tape. You'll stick it down like this, kind of to the table. Cool. And I find it's easier to move my ruler than it is to move the tape. Don't stick it down to the table or you'll never be able to get it back up. Okay, you'll take your first pieces and flip them over like this. Take your second piece and try to get it as even as you can. Lay it on top of the first piece. Now it's pretty sticky, so you don't have to worry about sticking it down well right now. We'll do that in a minute. Take your next piece, line it up with the edge as close to the edge as you can get, and stick it down. Take your last piece. And do the same thing. It's okay if you have some left like this, we can just trim that off. Grab your scissors. You want to check the edges on the back as well. If you have an edge like this, you'll do the same thing. This is easier if you use no stick scissors. I'm, of course, not using non-stick scissors. Now, once you have it all done, you want to lay it down and kind of get rid of any wrinkles. The wrinkles aren't a huge deal because you're about to turn this into a bow. But you want to pick which side looks best and that's going to be like the top part of your ribbon if you were to have a pattern on a ribbon. Take your other color of tape Measure it against what you have there. Cut it. Let it fall, just like we've been doing. And you'll want to take this and just kind of eyeball it to get it straight and lay it on top. Once you have this, we'll stick it down, flip this over, and cut this in a straight line to get rid of the edges. You want to do that on both sides. Stick it down one more time just to make sure everything's good and stuck together. And now you want to cut your fishtails. You'll fold your ribbon in half like this. I keep calling it ribbon, but it's tape. And you'll just Cut the edge off, and when you open it up, it looks like this. You'll want to do the same thing on the other side. Fold the tape in half. Now you want to use this as a guide, so your edges will be about the same. Now, if you have a little thing that does like that, you can just go in and fix it. And I don't like the way that white edge is showing, so I'm just going to trim it off. The next thing you're going to want to do is cut the center piece. You'll cut about this much off, and then you're just going to cut it in half. Pick whichever one of these looks the best, and that would be your center. Now fold this in half, just like this. Take the two halves and meet them in the middle. When you do this, this part is going to line up with the center of your bow. You'll take this and you'll just fold in and out, in and out until it's cute. 
Now this is not ribbon, so it's not going to fold as easy as ribbon. Once you have it, it should look like that. Take your center piece, start at the bottom so you can hide what you're doing, and fold it over like this. Now, the first time you just want to go around, all the way around. The next time, you want to grab your ponytail holder and tape it into the bow, just like this. Then, you'll keep going around until you stick it down. Now, take your bow and shape it. Here you have your duct tape to your bow. This is what it looks like in the back. This is what it looks like in the front.